One of the best ways to learn mathematics is not just by solving problems, but by solving the same problem in multiple ways. So in this video, I'm going to show you the fifth of nine solutions to this system of equations with a parameter. And this time we will use the derivative. The first equation can be solved for y, giving us two functions which look like this. And from the second equation, y equals minus 3 over 4 x plus a over 4. And if we want the system of equations to have a single solution, the line given by the second equation should be tangent to the graph of this function, which means that the value of the derivative at their common point should be equal to the gradient of the line. So in first case, we've got the derivative of plus squared root, which is equal to minus 2x divided by two squared roots of 100 minus x squared. We set it equal to the gradient and we have to be very careful solving the resulting equation because it involves squaring both sides of this equation, which will give us extraneous root of this equation. So we have x squared equals 36 and x equals plus or minus 6. But remember that we had 4x equals 3 squared roots, which means that minus 6 cannot be the root of this equation because the left hand side would be negative and the right hand side is always positive. So we have x equals 6. From this equation, we can find y. It will be equal to 8. And finally, the second equation in its original form gives us a, which is equal to 50. And if we do the same for the second function, y equals minus squared root, then we're gonna have a plus here, a minus here, which means that x equals minus 6 is the root. And for that case, we would have a equals minus 50. And that's the answer. And if you want to see other solutions of this problem with the parameter, check out the full video.